All right, so my ring light just broke. So um, we gotta rely on this one. Um, so Slumberland, Jason Momia. Um, it was good to see him again. And it was sad because the show that he was in called C about um, something, it, I wanna say something like zombies, but it wasn't about zombies, but just picture there's a zombie outbreak and all these people turn into zombies. Then it's like 30 people that try to fight to survive. So in his TV show, um, it was about the, there was a disease that happened, but instead of people turning into zombies, everybody went blind except for the kids. So that was the TV show that he was the main character. So I was happy to see him in Slumberland. And Slumberland basically was about um, him trying to help this little girl uh, to sleep. And he was like, a, um, come to find out at the end, well, I'm going to get to that in a minute, but it was like a, these people, the children and the grown-ups, mainly the, the, the kids, they had the power that when they went to sleep, they had powers. They had, like, superheroes and stuff when they would sleep. So she uh, happened upon Jason Momia and the, and the, and the thing, and they, they hooked up and they started trying to find her dad because her dad had went missing, you know, uh, prior to her becoming... I think she was like 15 or 16. So they're looking, you know, for her dad and stuff in the movie. And lo and behold, how about Jason Momia ends up being her long lost uncle. So, but he had been inside the sleep land for so long. If you're in there more than a month, a month is like two years in your real life lifetime. So he was in there for like a month. So he forgot who he was. So she she helped remind him, his niece helped remind him who he was. But it was a great movie. I had to watch it twice because as y'all know, I love Jason Momia. So it was, it was so good. I watched it twice and it was heartbreaking. It was loving. It was, it was just the perfect movie for this type of year. It's not a Christmas movie, but it was the perfect movie for this type of year. And my second uh, review is Benjamin Pratt from Galaxy uh, Guardians of the Galaxy. I wrote it down this time because I always forget the name. So from the Guardian Guardians of the Galaxy, Benjamin Pratt. Uh, this was like a Christmas special, so everybody knew that he, you know, that he no longer had any, you know, the um, Time Lord, that he didn't have no more family. So the girl, the alien girl with the little antenna things like a bee, her and the big muscle guy, the rest of the dude that used to be a wrestler, they went back to Earth and they kidnapped Kevin Bacon to take him back to the ship where uh time lord was at so he can so they can give him to time lord some lord time lord for his uh christmas present so she hypnotized him when they first got there she hypnotized him she said you're going to come with with us so, but it was so funny because he was running from them he was calling the cops and the cops showed up and everything and it was just hilarious because kevin bacon um he he looks good in this movie, but he didn't look good in the movie called Who, What, When, and Where or something like that. Oh, man, he looked terrible in that movie. But anyway, TV show. I'm sorry. Was it a movie? TV show? Nah, don't matter. I only watched it one time. But the, uh, but on here, the Guardians of the Galaxy with the, the Christmas special, that joint was hilarious. They were singing. They were dancing. They were doing all kinds of stuff that I ain't never seen them do before. And... It's a shame that the black girl wasn't in there no more. The one with the green uh, or blue, no, green, green skin. She wasn't on there. But the other sister was there. The one that looked like a robot, she was there. So they did this big old presentation. And when he found out that they kidnapped Kevin, he was like, take the, uh, the mind thing off of him, the enchantment thing off of him, and let him go back home to his family. That joint was hilarious. Okay, it was hilarious. So I said, oh my God. So Kevin Bacon was like, well, you know, even after they took the spell off of him, he still was like, well, 
I want to stay to help you celebrate Christmas. And he ended up being really cool. He ended up staying. They did the decorations, everything. So they had, he had a really good birthday. And I mean, Christmas. Why did I say birthday? He had a really good Christmas. And then they took Kevin Bacon back to Earth. And then it went off. But it was, it was good. It was, it was so funny. And we all know that Kevin Bacon can dance from Flashdance. I think that's what he was in. Um, but yeah, Kevin Bacon can dance his butt off, just like John Travolta, and they both sing. And that's what I like about the old, young, when I say old, young generation, I'm talking about people who've been acting for more than 20 years, because back then, they had to be able to sing, dance, tap dance, uh, uh, do their own choreography. They had to do, they had to be able to do everything, but the ones that, that come out today, they don't know how to do anything except act. That's it. They only know what to do, what they're told to do once that camera start run, rolling. That's it. So, but I hope everybody have a, or had a good Thanksgiving because I was sick and I think this is like my second video and I'm look at the time. I have six minutes. So, um, I just want to say, uh, Christmas is coming just that time of year. So, and then New Year's is right after that. Uh, matter of fact, I got to do my do a new year's eve video too but anyway um i um just hope that everybody's having a good time and i hope that everybody got their christmas stuff ready hope y'all not waiting to the last minute to get y'all christmas gifts for the ones who are shopping um i already gave mine out last week i already gave out my christmas stuff and i'm already shopping for next year that's how i do it because i don't like people i don't have i don't like waiting i don't like making people wait to get their stuff. You know what I'm saying? I do that when I give you your birthday, your Christmas, Father's Day, whatever. The next day, I'm already shopping or thinking about what I'm going to get you for next year. So with that being said, um, it's good to see you guys again. Um, thanks for liking and following me. Um, I will not be uploading no more dance videos because I'm still in restriction. And... Um, I don't want to get banned, so this is basically what you're going to see, this type of stuff. I'm not doing no more bikinis, only on my YouTube and my other platforms, that's it. I'm not, I'm not doing it on here, so, because I don't want them to, uh, to block me, so, I'm going to be fully dressed from now on, so, uh, I hope y'all still hang in there, I hope y'all are following me on my YouTube, and, um, because that's where my Christmas video is going to be posted at. Uh, on YouTube, it's going to be posted the day before Christmas. Um, my Christmas video, I already did it, and I already did my, my pictures and stuff. So, love y'all, and...